KSBW Weather with Art Jarrett. Well, welcome back. I want to take you back out to SkyCam A, Fremont Peak here. You can see the low clouds out in the distance, and yeah, they were really hard to shake. In fact, you can see all the way out there, clear skies well above, say about 900 feet. And other than that, these clouds are just kind of lulling by, having a good old time. Now, what kept them around? I'll talk to you about that in a second. But let's look at the temperatures. We cooled down significantly in some cases, down to about 7, 8 degrees, 75 in Scotts Valley. Very cool out there by Santa Cruz and Watsonville. Just very low to mild temperatures there. You see 68 in Seaside, 67 in Monterey, 73 out in Big Sur, and mild temperatures. You get into Carmel Valley, 75. Through the valley we go, mostly mild all the way down to uh, King City, 78 degrees. That uh, puts the pinnacles at around 85 today. And then right back into the Santa Clara Valley, more of the same, 86 to 85. In this particular area, they might even find themselves with a little bit of rainfall heading their way, as well as northeastern San, Juan, uh, San Benito County. Excuse me. Yeah, a little rain is starting to trickle back in. You can see it right here. Here it comes up to the spine. This is the monsoonal moisture yet again, but you see it's making a little bit of a curve heading back in Placerville, back to the fire, the King's Fire there, and heading right back here. So lightning can be associated with this. We can see this continuing on through the night. The pesky uh, culprit here, that's that low pressure system that's spinning right over us. Instead of heading back towards Southern California, which it was supposed to do, it's slowly getting lifted right back up into our area and continues to spin and bringing back a little bit of smoke with that as well. Well, that also means a little bit of rainfall is going to happen when this kicks out by Sunday evening. We're going to see rainfall chances come in, a little breezy conditions with a high pressure coming in for a couple of days. And then by Wednesday afternoon, here it comes, rainfall getting by the Golden Gate Bridge all the way down to Santa Cruz and then swinging by the Santa Lucia Mountains. Yeah, that could be something else for us. And when it's too late, it's too far far back right now to see when this is going to happen uh, as far as uh, I should say moisture is going to be concerned but I'm thinking about half an inch to an inch from the mountains down to the valleys here you have it. that moisture comes through and swirls through the Santa Clara Valley right back into areas of San Benito County so your temperatures for tomorrow 68 to 75 you go all the way down through parts of the San Francisco Bay Area 86 in Morgan Hill to 78 in Hollister we're going to see more sunshine down through the valley but temperatures will go up about a degree or two we'll see temperatures mostly around the upper 60s, you get into the peninsula, 75 in Big Sur. Over to Santa Cruz, we'll see 76 in mild and warm temperatures. You get into the mountains. Those clouds are going to roll on back. We'll expect a little local drizzle as well. Your seven day forecast, though, we're going to cool it down because yep, that rainfall is going to sneak in. Maybe last till Friday in some cases. So we'll go from showers or to rainfall to showers and then right back to more scattered showers. So that's a look at your coast side. So get out there and enjoy it before it all comes down. Raindrops. You're falling on my head. Been my waiting.